Why is it that we go on a five day trip and bring enough to do it like a multi-year expedition? Well, can you explain why one person needs 13 fishing rods. Okay, take this one down. Cover all bases. Okay, DMFD. No, no, you're gonna be watching yourself. <laughs> what? <laughs> the heck, dude. I'm doing it. So here's the scoop. We got about 15 minutes to get off this plane and on another one. Will it happen? Not sure. But if it doesn't happen, Gabe is more than likely to go slap crazy. We got what? Five hours? Five hour flight ahead of us? Okay, everybody, pick them up, lay them down. You think we're gonna make it? I hope. All right, race is on now, y'all. Okay. What's up, y'all? Take care, now. Have a good one. Come on, Cracker. What we're trying to do is get on this plane before it leaves us, right? <laughs> I, I hope he figured that out all on his own. We're trying to get on the next plane before it leaves without us. Does cameras, cameras, cameras. Cameras. <laughs> Wait till y'all see how much gear we have. Connection. Okay. Cabo. Los Cabos, Mexico. 5F. I knew it was F. 5F. That's rock. Gabe, do you feel like you're in that movie Rain Man right now? Welcome to Concourse F, everybody. This way. I'll race ya. Yeah. We're neck and neck. We made it, y'all. Boom, shakalaka. Hey, Gabe, let's hurry up. I ain't about all that waiting. They jack around getting cokes. Not me. I'm heading to my seat. Don't know what time it is. Taking off. We're in the air, y'all. It was tight, but we were able to make it here. We got on the plane, and uh, we got four hours. Cabos. From there, we got a driver that's going to take us five hours north to Magdalena Bay, aka Mag Bay. It's been on my bucket list for a long, long time. And I can't wait to get there. Just making it here to the Cabo. So excited. I actually just watched the movie Forrest Gump. Oh, so emotional. Drop a thumbs up if you like the movie Forrest Gump. Like I'm a huge sucker for like movies like that. Oh, crazy. Love my family. Sarah, Ari, Emma. Daddy loves you. Can't wait to see you. Touchdown, ladies and gentlemen. It's time to fish. Adios, El Capitan. <laughs> Look at him, cracker. I'm just making sure you got the other bag. Yeah, 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 yeah. You know, obviously we've been traveling a lot lately. It's a lot of fun, a lot of work. But man, it, it's such a blessing to be able to travel the way we are. It's crazy. Now here we are going to Mag Bay. Dream trip, y'all. All right, you guys. Hopefully all our reels made it good. So we had to pay about a thousand dollars in tax, y'all. But the moral of the story is, we're here. And I'm stoked about that. Como se llama? Jose. Jose. So that is Toby from Mag Bay Sport Fishing Lodge here. He met us here at the airport. We jumped in with Jose. We got a whole like, I mean, seriously, we've got a full busload of gear. And. Uh, this is unique. You know, I have wanted to fish Mag Bay for at least 15 years. And so to actually have the opportunity, and we're not gonna be solely looking for striped marlin or blue marlin. We're just here, we've got a ton of gear. We're gonna look for all types of different fish. We're gonna have challenges between me, Gabe, and Kelly in Austin. We're gonna have a great time. And uh, I'm just stoked to be here. 
what I wasn't expecting is such huge, beautiful mountains. Yes, sir. We left our expectations at the door. We're here to have a good time. And you are riding shotgun. Okay, you guys, so we're on the north side of town here. This place is legit. Ooh. Look at that, y'all. Dude, what's going on? <laughs> what are you doing? You just got kissed right in the mouth by a little baby horse. Why? All right, so we've got about a four and a half hour ride north, heading to Magdalena Bay, y'all. Guys, the sun's going down on the first day here. We started out this morning at 4 a.m. when we left my house. Flew to Atlanta, flew to Cabo San Lucas. Now we're driving north. This whole trip has been exciting because, you know, it's not just about the fish. It's about the whole entire adventure. And uh, if this trip is anything like today, we're gonna have an amazing time, man. Can't wait to get the lodge, see what we've got to deal with, and then tomorrow morning we'll be out on the boat. Look how beautiful this is. We just uh, got here to this grocery store. We're in the town of Constitution right now. We're probably about a half hour, 45 minutes from the lodge. Got to stock up because we're going to cook. We got to have some ingredients. Hey, what y'all hunting over there? Labor avocado. avocado. So they actually have really, really, really good produce here. I'm shocked. I mean, this stuff is awesome. All right, you guys. There's Jose. Look at look at the van. But will you look at it? We, we are literally jacked up. You just can't put much more into a van than this. But you know what? We are locked, cocked, and ready to rock. We are arriving, ladies and gentlemen. Oh, look at there. We got a ponga, ready to roll. Just getting here. It's uh, 8.34 p.m. Mountain Standard Time. We're just arriving. Gonna unload, check out everything, and make a plan. Gracias. This is the little town of San Carlo. It's in the Mag Bay area, Magdalena Bay area. And if you're into sport fishing, primarily for striped marlin, this is heaven. This is as good as it gets, and it's prime time. We're about to find out if our rod's made it. Gabe, give me a knife. Just come cut this. Good thing I was just talking about this. <laughs> I guess that's a big enough knife to cut the tape. I'm gonna need this to clean the fish on my game. Now here's the funny thing. I didn't expect it to be chilly, and we wrapped my rods up with my with my frog hog jacket. Wait, wait, wait. wait. With, with his frog tongue jacket? This was mud. No. You are odd. You are Did you smoke some exhaust for you? I don't see any broken tips, y'all. That's a good sign. They have massive, massive broom tail groupers. And if you watch the video where I caught that giant Goliath grouper, I caught it on this rod. Got a 100 pound braid, 200 pound leader, send down some kind of huge live bait. We're gonna get tight, sucker. 
So you guys, we just got done rigging up all of our gear. Gabe was giving me such a hard time back at the house. Why are you bringing so many rod and reels? And I'm like, well, if I don't bring them, I certainly can't use them. Well, now they're all rigged up, they're ready to go, and it's obvious that there's so many opportunities. But the cool thing is, Toby, man, thank you very, very much. This guy's got an epic staff, epic crew, and the pad here. This place is so sick, and you guys are gonna see it, but this is just a little travel vlog going from home down here to Magdalena Bay. For many, many years, I've been wanting to come to Mag Bay. This is the tip of the iceberg. This is the best place in the world if you're looking for a striped marlin or a zillion other fish that they have around here. But that's all I got for you tonight. We'll see you tomorrow. Take care, God bless, and we are gone.